Monday Night Raw. Welcome to Balor Club. James the following Dean Poole, contest John is a Wayne Tuff. Four-way tables match and is for the Intercontinental Championship. Introducing the challenger from Bray, Howie Whitlow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn. One of the most incredible athletes to ever step foot in Monday Night Raw, Finn Balor, first ever Universal Champion. This man is an enigma with a profound skill set that we have never witnessed before. A world-renowned superstar. Former NXT champion, the first ever Universal Champion, Finn Balor, ladies and gentlemen, is for real. Guys, if you are looking for a billboard example of a superstar who has it, who has the it factor, Look no further than Finn Balor. And introducing the challenger from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 263 pounds, the Dominator. This won't be pretty, guys, Bobby as it's now Lashley. time for a fatal four way tables match. Cole, it's matches like this that make me happy I retired. There is no way these superstars don't walk out of here without serious injury. Introducing the challenger from Hollywood, Florida, weighing in at 218 pounds, Dolph Ziggler. Not about showing off anymore for Dolph Ziggler because he believes he's accomplished everything he needs to in WWE, and he's right. Dolph Ziggler made it his personal mission to eliminate the complacency that plagues the WWE locker room. Month after month, the preaching is the same. Dolph Ziggler truly believes no one can hang on his level. And introducing the champion from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 225 pounds, he is the Intercontinental Champion, Dean M. Rose. Guys, what can we expect from this fatal four-way tables match here tonight? You mean aside from four competitors doing everything humanly possible to not get thrown through a table, Cole? Other than that, I can say with confidence that we will see one poor soul actually get put through a table.
And we're underway with what will likely be a wild tables match. Any one of these four competitors can win this match, guys, which is what makes this fatal four-way so unpredictable. Spinning kick to the gut. Oh, oh man, that hurt. Oh, nasty impact. Ooh, what impact. Ooh. Back now inside the ring. Ooh. Right to the back. Oh, flying forearm. That'll turn your lights out. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, man. What a strike. Oh, what a forearm. Dirty. Boom, what impact. What a stomp. Good grief. Close line. A concerned look on the face of the champ. Oh, he's a true champion. I suspect he has plenty of fight left in him. Guys, it's easy to say NXT is a pillar of WWE nowadays, but it would be difficult to imagine where it would be without the influence of Finn Balor. He was the face of NXT. NXT exploded into a phenomenon during Finn's reign as NXT champion. You gotta believe this one's over. Nailed it. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Knee stop. That'll ruin your leg. Touching on Michael's point about Finn Balor's time in NXT, Finn's time wasn't only beneficial to NXT, the two years Balor spent at NXT made him the man he is today and the performer he is in the ring. Balor is the longest reigning NXT champion there's ever been. He was champion for 292 days. That means being in the main event of every show, every night of the week. Harsh impact. This might be it. Oh my. Beautiful technique. Boom! <laughs> what a forearm! Man, Sigler gets out of the way quickly. Lightning speed from Dolph. Boom! Oh, what a drop kick on the mark. The challenger's championship dreams are fading quickly. Don't be surprised if he can't find a way to bounce back here in this fatal four-way match. He's in big trouble here. I don't think I remember ever seeing him this much off his game. It's like he tapped into some unseen energy source. here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? That is a huge opening for Dolph Ziggler. Big one. He's making a statement here with this attack. What a slam. Impactful. It'll jar your spine. Oh, nasty impact. So much has been said about Finn Balor being the first WWE Universal Champion, but the challenge he overcame to gain that opportunity shouldn't be overlooked. Yeah, a week after the 2016 draft, Finn Balor's debut ushered in what was called the new era of Monday Night Raw as he beat the odds in a fatal four-way match before going on to defeat Roman Reigns. Using the elbow as a weapon. Backbreaker! Reflecting on Finn Balor's main roster debut. No, there he is! Oh, 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 what a response! There it is! Ooh. Oh, what a punch! That's how you stop your opponent. Big time slam. Vicious. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose. Beautiful technique. The champ's in a bad way now, Cole. What a strike. Wow, reverse bulldog. He got him good. You're not going to win many matches absorbing punishment like that. This might be it! Oh, my! Oh, a buckle bomb! The and table uh, they've got him. Big victory in the fatal four-way. 
I can't believe what we just saw. Tables matches are fan favorites for a reason, folks. He ain't messing around. And here's a last look at this one. The dust is settled, and there's your winner of this fatal four-way match. Wow, somehow he made turning back three of WWE's top superstars look somewhat easy. East Rutherford hasn't sat down since the bell rang. I think they're in awe over what they just saw.